This is David Rosen from Wolfire Games. In this video, I'll show you Overgrowth Beta 6, the final version before Overgrowth 1.0. This update features the full story mode for you to play through, so you can make sure that it's stable and balanced. It has an integrated tutorial on the first few levels to help teach the controls and basic game mechanics to new players. There's still a very high skill ceiling though, so experienced players can approach each problem in a number of different ways. We need your feedback on this last beta to help make sure we have a good difficulty curve. So please let us know if you get stuck somewhere, or if you find particular areas too easy or too hard. These new levels are much more detailed and rich than any we've had before, so we can also use feedback from players with lower end machines so we can make sure it runs well for as many players as we can, and so we can give accurate minimum and recommended system specs. The best way to give us feedback of any kind is to email it to bugs at wolfire.com. That will put it on our tracker so we can figure out what to do about it. I can't go over all the changes for this update because there's way too many, but I'll give some highlights. Characters can now get impaled on spikes, so try not to jump on them. Cats can use and throw offhand weapons like daggers. Rats can have bits of the environment attached as camouflage. After winning a battle, AI characters now react in a variety of different ways. Splashing through water can now alert nearby enemies, even while sneaking, so try to stay on land if possible. There's a lot of new transition effects to smooth out dialogue and level changes. That's it for this video. If you'd like to try this final beta for yourself and get a free copy of Receiver and Low Light Combat, then go to wolfire.com purchase. If you'd like to hear about development news as soon as it happens, you can follow us on Twitter at Wolfire.